one of the biggest challenges uh, for the movie in general, but these sequences in particular, uh, was the fact that we were shooting in an actual like, turn-of-the-century farmhouse. So most of these rooms were incredibly tiny and had very sort of angular roofs up on the second floor. So both the blocking and the lighting became extremely complicated. Uh, it would have been possible, I think, like three or four years ago, my cinematographer Brendan had been playing around with LED lighting strips that... Um, completely saved us. There was always long, these little thin strips taped to the ceiling, taped in any place he could put them, uh, just to be able to get the right tone of light in such small confined spaces. And then of course, in sequences with people moving down hallways, passing into multiple rooms, it just, it was to not be bumping over each other was a constant uh, fight. If we'd had more money, this would have definitely been a set build. But uh, we found this one perfect house that gave us both a bunch of great um, uh, interior and exterior locations. This scene right here, for example, this is actually two rooms where we, we were allowed to knock down a wall and combine two rooms. Because even just the simple distance of her walking into that room uh, towards um, the closet in just a moment would have been completely impossible in that closet. It was actually on the location, but we built it. So that was the closest to a set we had for the whole movie, combining uh, tearing down two rooms and creating one big room with a closet. And that's movie making on a budget.